Do you want to know the real reason that CEOs hate remote work in 2024? It has very little to do with corporate real estate and a lot to do with controlling you. Here's a brief history on remote work. Remote work became massively popular during the pandemic. Because of government restrictions, companies knew the only way that they could stay in business was to offer remote work. So we saw a lot of really big companies that said that they would never allow people to work remotely, suddenly offering everybody remote work so they could keep in business. But something interesting happened during this period. Employees realized that they could get their job done, still get results, and even more, they could live their life. They could literally plan work around their life. For the first time, people truly had a work-life balance. The problem with this, companies hate it. They hate paying you a salary and not owning your life. And it's a lot easier to own someone's life when they're in the office compared to being at home. Now, what you'll notice is once those restrictions were lifted, companies didn't immediately force people back to the office. And that's because we had the great resignation and the only way you could attract top talent was to offer remote work. But as soon as we shifted to an employer market, companies took their opportunity to force people back to the office. So we will see a return to remote work once we swing back into a candidate market, which will happen sooner or later. But that's the real reason that remote work died.